But for now, for about a decade prior to 2020, Burlington used to average two gunfire incidents per year. According to Mayor Moreau Weinberger, since the start of 2020, the Queen City has had 38, including a dozen so far this year. Local 22's Mike Hoey joins us live from the newsroom tonight with more on a news conference this afternoon. Mike. Well, Lauren, at that news conference, Burlington Police Acting Chief John Murad said the department has identified the shooter in 19 of the 38 incidents and made arrests in 18 of them. Chittenden County State's Attorney Sarah George said a confluence of factors has led to this, including economic hardship, increases in gun purchases, and reduced police staffing. Well, to that point, the mayor noted the Burlington PD cannot do what it's historically done to curb violence or the possibility of it with the effective staffing level of 60 officers that it has right now. He added asking the BPD to do so would simply be asking too much, adding that the Queen City needs to do everything it can to rebuild the department's ranks. To rebuild the officer ranks to the now authorized headcount of 87, we need the city council to approve and demonstrate their full support for the rebuilding plan that I will be submitting in my FY23 budget uh, that I'll be submitting to the council next week. Lauren, the mayor also demanded action today from both the federal and state levels on gun control, noting he'll be advocating for it himself in Montpelier in the next legislative session. Live from the newsroom, Mike Hoey, Local 22 News. Mike, Plattsburgh police appear to be close to identifying who may be involved in the killing of a woman last weekend.